Welcome to Toffee TV. It is the instant match reaction. Apollo Limassol nil, Everton three. A good win to cap off, which has been a pretty terrible Europa League campaign. But nice to cap it off with a win. Obviously, much changed team um, from what we've seen in the last couple of games. Obviously, some senior players in there, like some Morales, Klassen, um, Snyderlin, um Players like Vlasic and, and, and players like Luckham who have had senior games. Um, but obviously a lot of young players as well, like some Morgan F Morgan Feeney playing. Um, Hornby playing up front, Charlesley. Uh, ben Engemi has played you know, a handful of games. So it was a real mix. Um, and I thought you know we started the game quite well. Very bright, just trying to play nice football. Obviously the pressure was off, nothing, nothing really to play for. And it felt like that early on, and we got we got going, and, and you know we we kept the ball going, um, made some good chances, and obviously um, Adam Oman, Adam Ola Luckman took a couple of those, and his first goal was excellent. He I think he just but well, he just had a decent chance to score, or or possibly pass to um, pass inside uh, to Klassen, and he 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 took it himself, missed the chance, but he kept going, and, and a good cross from Vlasic has uh, teed him up for a header, which he took really well actually. Um, obviously not something you you associate with his game, but he took it really well, and that confidence flowed. And after a really good session of keep ball, he's got the ball outside the box and smashed another one in. You know, showing all that confidence. And when he's in those areas, he looks a real player. You know, he's taking on defenders who are scrambling to get back. He looks he looks a real player. And playing off the left probably suits him a little bit more. He can come inside. He's played off the right recently. I don't think that suits him as well as playing off the left. To be honest, he's more of a player who should be playing round the box. But I think playing off the left suits him a hell of a lot more. Um, he took the goal really well. Could have had a hat-trick in the second half. Again, some people say he was selfish. Maybe he could have passed it to inside. I think it was to Vlasic, but he took it himself. And the way he played, he deserved that. I mean, there were times, certainly in the second half, where he gets a little bit ahead of himself and plays dangerous passes in dangerous areas of the pitch, which he shouldn't be doing. But um, he's he's got that, you know, he's got that something that could... If honed right, could uh, be, could be a key thing. So I thought he played really well tonight. Um, Klassen, I thought, was really good as well from start to end. I thought his attitude was excellent. Always in the right place, using all his experience. Um, always there with like a winning tackle or just get himself in the way. In fact, if you watch, if you watch um, Luckman's second goal, you take it back all the way to the start. It's just him forcing them to give the ball away by being in the right place at the right time. I thought he was excellent all the way through, really consistent performance. And he, he's one for me, I think, that could force his way back into the first team. I think now that all the players have settled in, I think if there's an opportunity, I think he could take it. I think he's got the will to want to achieve at Everton Football Club, and I really hope he does, because I think he's, he's got the right attitude completely, um, where others maybe haven't. Yeah, so I thought they were excellent. Um, I thought the whole of the back four did brilliantly, considering it was really three players playing out position. I know Bessage can play centre back, but it was really three players playing out position. In, and as I said in the, in the, in the middle there, uh, Feeney was, it was, it was excellent. Wins everything in the air. Reminds me of a of a of a Dave Watson type player. I thought he was I thought he was brilliant tonight. Um, Charles did well at left back, and Benigni did well at right back against you know senior senior experienced players. I thought they did really well. It was just a really good play, good performance. I think at times we overdid it because I think it was it was that mix of like being a pre season game or almost like they knew they were better than the teams and we tried to overdo it at times where we could have we could have um been a little bit more direct and just played the ball first time and simplified it. I think you know Luckman was guilty of that and uh, and Vlasic certainly was guilty of that. Um but you know we we had so many chances actually when you look back we had six or seven clear cut chances um you know i think it was a broadhead came on and set Steph Vlasic up and he should have just took a first time but took a touch but in the end Vlasic just scored a really good goal you know a great first touch to beat the defender and then finishes it really well and again he's another one if he gets his head down and just keeps the right attitude he'll get chances and then you know that's what we want we want people fighting to get in that first team you know no one should have um no one should have their place set in stone. There's there's opportunities there for players, and some players tonight I took them. I thought Snyder did all right as well. A bit strange to see him as the captain, considering everything's gone on. But I thought he did okay. Showed us all his experience, especially in the second half when it was getting a little bit ragged and they were having a little bit of a go and they was they were throwing themselves around to win fouls. 
Um, but but um, you know they they've kept their heads and and got through and, and won it comfortably in the end. So good performance. Really good to see so many young players making debuts. Sixteen year olds coming on and. Um, you know, I thought Holmby did well up front as well. He didn't get too much. It was almost like the players didn't know who he was, so it didn't really want to pass to him. You know, you've ever turned up at training at someone else's team, and you probably know how he felt tonight. But I thought he did really well, just keeping hold of the ball, just winning the ball in the air, and just and just just holding it. I thought he did brilliantly. And for a young lad, if he can add other parts to his game, and the, you know the size of him, Everton could have a player there, or certainly you know uh, could be a player. Maybe not for Evan, but for someone else, because really, he's got he's got he's got all those all those things to do well. So, really good night. Um, again, on larger scale, it's it's three games unbeaten, three clean sheets. Okay, it's a completely different defense that's played in the last two games and will play on on Sunday. But just for Everton as a whole, just for confidence, just for building confidence, just for um, getting the club, you know. Backed into the winning ways, it was brilliant, and and it gives Sam Allardyce food for thought, even for Sunday, for who's going to be on the bench. You look at Luckman now and think, can I bring Luckman on with twenty minutes to go, and can he affect the game, or you know, whatever. The whole Christmas period coming up now, there's games after games after games. I know we've been used to that, but it would be nice to, it would be nice to have different options. Certainly, Luckman, Luckman's the one where you say, if you can get him in and around the box, he can cause trouble. Get him in the right areas of the pitch, and he'll cause trouble. Okay, he's got things to learn in terms of when to pass, when not to pass, when to take people on. We're on, we're on the pitch to do certain things, but he could, he could be one, he could be one that could come on and inspire um, us to get goals. So, as I say, not too much to add to that. Good performance. Nice to finish off with a good, with a win. We don't become the first English team not to win a game in the Europa League. Uh, we didn't finish bottom. Um, and we've won a game of football, and that's what it's all about. So let me know your thoughts in the comments. Uh, keep an eye out for Baz's instant reaction, player ratings, and the final word, and I'll see you later.